welcome back to my channel my name is Maritza and this is my home away from home oh my goodness I can't believe it that I just thank you to everybody that's joined the family to everyone that's hit that subscribe button thank you so much and thank you for the love that everyone got like showed me in the last video where I was trying out like uh, you know bridesmaid dresses I can't believe that people actually loved the black dress like who wants to see someone in black at a wedding so I was really surprised about that but thank you for everyone for liking the video for commenting and telling me your thoughts I'm gonna do a part two to that video as well um, but this time I'll order all the clothes without ever input so it will be up on the channel soon anyway so today I am back with a video about skincare so one of the things that I get a lot of compliments on is my skin uh, surprisingly enough I get a lot of compliment on my skin and everybody's always asking me like what I'm using and what's going on or what do I do to keep it so clean so first and foremost I have to admit that I am just really I'm blessed by my mom's genes and you know all of that they have good genes because I've, I've never really had bad skin I think the worst I've had is really really dry skin but I want to share with you some of the products that I've really been enjoying especially now that we're going into the summer months so one of the big things that I do for my skin is moisture 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 I am big on moisturizing and especially when you go to bed I just I am glistening I am oily <laughs> so yeah that's one of the things I am big on and SPF 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 um, those are the two things that I'm good at um, but I, SPF is something that's come on really late in my skincare routine but since the day that I met it <laughs> it's like been continuous and it's very tricky I've gone through a whole lot of SPF some of them make me blue gray and now I finally found the right perfect the perfect one so without further ado grab something to drink and then I will show you what it is that I use so, welcome back so one of the things the key things to having a good um, skincare routine and having good skin is having a good face wash or body wash I use Dr. Bonner's Castile soap or I also use uh, this black soap um, this African black soap uh, this is simply from Amazon you can get a package from Amazon if you want and basically with um, black soap is that it's naturally curated uh, it's really good for your skin it helps kind of get rid of dead skin and bacteria and lighten up dull skin so black soap this is a staple in like a lot of um, African homes so especially West African so I would highly recommend if you have dry skin or you have like just flaky skin try use this just for one month and see how you feel and then you know so black soap and the next thing that I love doing is, and I said to you guys that I love moisture, 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 moisture. So I'm big on moisture. Right now, I'm really obsessed with this moisturizer by CeraVe, or yeah, CeraVe. And I like it because it's got three essential um, caramides and hyaluronic acid. And I'm a big fan of hyaluronic acid and glycolic acid. Um, I don't know if you've ever seen any of my videos where I've talked about some of the skincare products that I use. They really have acids in them. And the reason why I love CeraVe is because I've got... Um, what people call chicken skin and it's like little lumps on the skin and so by using CeraVe it just helps smooth in that skin area and just makes it kind of look smooth and nice to touch but I use it on my body and I use this cream as well on my face which is great and I think you know if you can if it's not good enough for the body then why is it, like if it's good enough for the body why is it not good enough for the face that's my reason another thing that I love 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 to do is um, do a peel so right now I have the Inky List, well I've had this for quite some time and it's nearly finished now. Uh, Inky Apple Cider Vinegar Peel. I use this once a week and once I've used that, it's just simply wash your face and that's it. And then put it on damp skin and take it off. Once I've used that, I always, always go in with a face mask. Ladies, it's important to have a couple of face masks or face sheets with you at home. So you can have your own little relaxing time I love doing I do face mask or face sheet at least once a week or if I'm feeling really fancy twice a week but um, yes I got these from a, a, a subscription box called Lang subscription box is it Lang or Lang? Lang Lang I can't believe it's a Korean one if I remember to when I get the next order I'll show you guys what it looks like okay and then on to the next moisturizer that I just obsessed with uh, I'm obsessed with this 
Hydro, I don't know if you can see it. It's called Blue Bomb Hydro Sorbet AA. And this is actually from a Polish brand. And this was sent to me by my friend Eva. And I just, it smells so beautiful. And look at it, look at how it looks. I don't know if you can see it, I hope you can. Nice and blue. And it is like the most beautiful thing ever. I'll just, the texture is, just look at it. Just beautiful, look at that. It's so beautiful and so moisturizing. I usually put this on just before I go to bed in the evening. I really double moisturize. I think it's really, really important. Like I said, you know, I, one of the things as to why my skin remains so youthful and plump, especially face, and especially now that summer's coming on, is just to remain moisturized at all times. I also have an oil that I use. It's run out now, but I'm due for a new one. I use rosehip oil as well as part of my skincare routine. I love rosehip oil and I use the organic version. I got this from a, a small business on Amazon and I just prefer to go organic rather than anything. And Ellis Piss Labs, it's from a lab company that produces it and manufacture it here in the UK. If you want to find out more about it, let me know. I'll be happy to provide you with a link brand um, I used to use another Polish brand before but this was sent to me by Eva and uh, look at it and I love it and it goes a long way it's like a butter right so it's like this in texture I'll show you like that see it nice and thick and again another staple in my in my skincare routine <laughs> I just moisturize all the time and it's beautiful it smells gorgeous it has like this vanilla finish Again, another organic one. This is another butter that I use. And I, what I do is I sometimes just alternate. So one week I'll use a, a whole lot of moisturizers for a full week. And then the next week I'll just double it down a little bit or just change it up a little. Um, and then last but not least, it's your girl. Like I said, SPF, SPF. You need to find yourself a great SPF. So I have two different SPFs. I've got this one by um, Garnier and I use this for my body it smells a little bit alcoholic but I use this for my body and then this one by CeraVe which I use for my face this is a, say, a face moisturizer as well as it having SPF and I use this during the day again one of the things I like about it is it's a transparent one I also like the pump I love the way that and you could just I think it helps you maximize how much of the product you get um yeah one of my favorite favorite um facial moisturizer it's good to have a facial moisturizer but it's great to have one that has SPF and I use this particularly in the day rather than in the evening um in the evening I just want to be greasy and oily and not sexy but one thing that I use, another thing that I also want to introduce you guys to is my body, my Coco Radiant Body uh, <laughs> Moisturizer. Yeah, it is. This is perfect for the summer. Perfect, perfect. It smells like cocoa, literally smells like cocoa. And again, you know, another double down. So I double moisturize my body. Um, so what I would do is usually typically use this first. Once I get out, first thing when I get out the shower and then use this second just before i go back to bed just before i go to bed so yeah that's it. and so if you ever want to know what products i use for my skin those are the products i use for my skin from time to time especially in the winter i'll change it up a little bit maybe i'll throw in a little bit of the ordinary and a few acids in in the winter but it's only in the winter i never really use harsh chemicals during the summer or spring months just because you know i think there's more um you might burn your skin a little bit more just because of the sun and the heat and all of that so i try not to do that I try and do all of the chemical peels and stuff like that in the winter and plus nobody's gonna see your skin in the winter not as much anyway so yeah that's it about the skincare that i use i hope you guys like this video and i'll see you in the next video thank you bye